Hello everybody. I hope this finds you well. I had a little time off from my busy schedule to try to make this little video. Now, um, a lot of people out there, you know, you see the signs. God give us the signs to look for. A lot of people like to tell you what everything means. And a lot of people have different interpretations of what it means. And you can tell which ones are right, though. You know, Luke. 17 verse 20 and when he was demanded of the Pharisees when the kingdom of God should come he answered them and said the kingdom of God cometh not with observation you're going to see it coming Neither shall they say, Lo, here, or lo, there. For behold, the kingdom of God is within you. He said unto the disciples, this be later, I guess, the days will come when ye shall desire to see one of the days of the Son of Man, and he shall not and ye shall not see it. The disciples weren't going to see it. And they shall say unto you, See here, or see there, or go after them, nor go after them, nor follow them. So someone's saying, See here, it's it's gonna happen on this date, or it's fixing to happen this year or next year. Don't listen to them. Don't follow them. They're full of it. For as the lightning that lighteneth out of one part under heaven shineth unto the other part under heaven, show still also the Son of Man in his day. What's he saying there? Can you predict when a lightning bolt's going to just pop right out there and strike? But first must he suffer many things and be rejected of this generation. As it was in the days of Noah, so shall it be in the days of the Son of Man. Which generation is he talking about? Is he talking about the generation of the apostles there, of the disciples at that time? What was he talking about? the last generation the coming of the Son of Man. What was going on in the days of Noah? Well, men were fortin' with demons. They had uh, genetically altered life. Like Monsanto's doing. they wished. Nothing beyond man's thoughts was beyond man's ability. They were murdering each other like it was nothing because there was no law about it. If Cain could get away with it, and so could I. To make you say, who are you to say any better? Moral decline had gotten so bad that only one family Still, stay clean of it. That's sad. That's sad. A 
for you like that now. Has everybody gotten so corrupted? I still see a lot of good people out there doing good works for Christ. Whether they're saved or not, I don't know. I don't know their hearts. God does. He knows who you are. Ask yourself this question. You died this instant. Would you be saved? Would you know where your soul was going? still bitterness towards someone in your heart? There's still something here on this earth holding you that you don't want to give up so bad. Try to stay at peace I know things are difficult now. I know people are stupid and get on your nerves. I know the government screwed up. I also know that there's a bunch of wacko elitists that think they need to cull the useless eaters. thing new about it is the speed in which everything moves now. We live in uh, interesting times indeed. Our knowledge is growing exponentially, but the wisdom to use that knowledge properly is still in its infancy. There is a danger that the technology, well there always has been this danger since the nuclear age, that the technology will be more than our ability to keep under control nuclear industry is demonstrating this one quite well at Fukushima and other facilities around the world. Not a good record, nuclear industry. And you still push it as the clean, efficient form of energy. must long belong to those people that want to reduce the population. Sadly, you seem to want to turn the world into a desert, too. Do you think you'll escape it? If there is life on Mars, they're living in terrible conditions in underground shelters. <laughs> Not likely a place you want to go. Visit. But, uh, so far, there's still some good to say. People wasting too much time in politics to do anything about it. Meanwhile, the rest of us are too busy just trying to pay the bills. We need free energy. It's there. Transition. 30 years to transition nuclear energy. Give me a break. 40 years to clean up Fukushima. You know, will there be a world left in 40 years if they continue like it is? Great. Will the ocean still be alive, or will it just be full of blind dolphins and stuff? 
Yeah, time to hang this one up.